guys, I'm in the lab and I wanted to show you really quickly the new iTunes Connect. You guys have probably gotten an email about this recently. Um, iTunes just released uh, this new, I, I, don't, I don't think this uh, iTunes Connect is new, but the actual way to manage podcasts are. So the way you get here, if you didn't see this email come through, if you're a podcaster and you have a podcast in iTunes, you've probably seen this come through. But if not, you just go to iTunes, connect, and then uh, it will take you to this portal here. And then you can just go ahead and log in. You log in with your same ID that you use for your Apple ID. If you forgot it, you can just click down here. But I'm going to just go ahead and log in. It's going to take you to a dashboard with your podcasts. And as you can see here, these are past podcasts and current podcasts. This is, um, you know, you can see everything here is active except for this show, which I don't use anymore. That was like my very first show. But if you click on the actual podcast, you'll see there's some, so there's some content here. You can see this is my, uh, this is my title, my podcast. This is my my URL that I use for iTunes for my for my feed for my RSS feed, and then they got this little this little mirror URL down here. And um, yes, it's got some pretty cool features. You can also submit your podcast. Uh, usually, you'd have to submit it through actual the iTunes app. But now you can actually submit it through, uh, through this uh, podcast connect application. So you have two different views here. If I hit this plus button, it's gonna ask me for my feed. I can validate my feed using that. I don't. I'm, I don't have a feed here to validate, but I'm just showing you guys this. And you can validate it, or you can also submit it here. So that's that makes life a little bit easier, you know, instead of having to go all the way over to iTunes. And then you can actually go in here and you can delete podcasts. So I can delete this if I don't want it anymore. Obviously, it's not active. Um, I wouldn't want to delete any of these because they're active. And then there is actually some resources and help that they added uh, in this in this uh, this partner iTunes partner dot apple dot com is the URL, but you can see here that there's some there's some really cool stuff that they that they went into detail in explaining. So if I click on, you know, <clears throat> I go to this is actually the overview. Um, tells me about a little bit about Podcast Connect, the requirements for. Uh, using their system it talks about creating a podcast, submitting a podcast, testing the feed, validating submission. It's really clean. It's, it's really clean. I like this. Um, talks about marketing your podcast. Some things that you guys may not know about down here um, is getting your podcast featured, which I thought this was really cool. So they tell you kind of some of the requirements to get your podcast featured. And then if you um, also um, want to request a provider page. So this is something that I, I think is really cool. You can have all your podcasts on one page. It tells you a little bit about that. So this is just a brief overview. I just wanted to let you guys know that Podcast Connect is here. And it's a, it's a great platform for managing you know, your show for submitting your shows to iTunes, you use your Apple ID, and um, that's all you really need to, in your RSS feed, so you don't really have to go back over to iTunes like you used to the old way, and I think this is going to make life a lot easier, there's a lot of instruction here, some resources, um, talks about tags, so everything you need to know uh, in terms of iTunes is, is pretty much here from their end. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Leave some comments below. If, if you guys have discovered something or came across something I haven't, or you guys have submitted 
your uh, RSS feed and you're getting some issues or, you know, let me know how, how it is when you, when you guys start testing it out. I haven't tested it out. I actually just received confirmation today about this. Um, so I'd love to hear your feedback in the comments.